All right, everybody. In front of me here, I got Don Maki episode five. Um, last episode, we had uh, Bell and the crew getting to know those uh, Xenos a little bit. The like friendly monsters that you know they've they've been chilling down in the dungeon. They have their own little safe spots. That's how they've been surviving. But we ended off the episode with those um, Ikalos pricks just rolling up on like Ween's squad. They all, they all like I mentioned it last episode. Splitting up, dumb idea, especially in a dungeon. Like, come on, guys. I know your monsters are tough, but. Splitting up, like, have you never watched Scooby-Doo? Is that ever a good idea? Uh, anyway, just, yeah, so, I'm guessing Ween's about to get captured. Probably taken somewhere to the Ikalos family's, like, area. Um, unless they can fight him off, but they already took out one of the monsters, like, with one swing. So, it's not looking great. Yeah, this, that's really all that I know. Uh, I know maybe... You know, no, I have no fucking clue what is going to happen this episode. I think we'll probably see Bell doing something. I, I don't know, just, yeah, they're getting captured. Maybe Bell will find out and, like, go after her. Maybe not yet. I, I don't know how they'd find out. They were already out of the dungeon by the time they got attacked. So, I don't know, just have to wait and see, I guess. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's all I got to say. So, um... We will just hop right into it. I don't know if that Ikalos, the god himself, is fully, like, evil or not. He doesn't seem to really, like, care too much from what we've seen. Like, he just lets his family do whatever the heck they want. It seems. Tries not to get in their way. Okay, so... Okay, they're putting up a bit of a fight. Some of them are actually decent, it seems, with the combat. Oh, but I think these guys are a little too prepared. Oh, god damn. That was pretty brutal. Yeah, this ain't going well for you, buddy. I'm sorry. Is that a minotaur? I can't even tell. The horns look different. aren't needed yeah so they're just killing everybody except ween i guess or maybe just that guy at least they didn't want to deal with him oh that was foe god no i forgot about foe that was the good guy that i liked was, oh come on straight up just executed foe oh God damn, man. Those guys are strong. What did they say? He was level four? Just that one dude? I mean, I wouldn't want to eat either if everybody was just staring at me like that. To be fair to Bell. Get to hauling. Okay, so they are taking the others. They're not killing them all. Deal with her here. Fuck, man. Please tell me the, like, uh, lead pulls up with the rest of the crew. Have some fun with it. They just spy. You know what? Just forget it. F fucking creepy ass bastards. Ever get enough of this? They really. They really be being turned on by a spider right now. For real. That's what you get, boys. Ah, uh, yeah. To put up a bit of a fight, at least. Didn't let that shit happen. Oh. Absolutely bitch slapped that man. We'll never violate this body. Okay. Right, she's the one that... Like, was talking about how much humans sucked last episode, right? I'm sure this is helping a lot. Uh, gross. To who? Gross. 
What is that? Okay. Sacrificed herself? What the heck was that? Okay, so just put her down. God damn, man. What absolute scum. Yep. They showed up too late. They're already gone. Oh. Oh. Bell, are you gonna hesitate? Remember what Lead told you. Yeah. Put that shit down. Good man. Good man. Yeah, he has to think about it a little more. It's tough, that's for sure. To kill monsters. Yeah, it's... I can see where he's coming from. Because, like, do all monsters have the capacity to be good? Like, lead and ween and all them? Or is it only certain ones? It's... I can see why it would be so, like, screwy to think about. Oh, is that A's? Sup, A's? How is you going? Oh. So the Ikalos have their own way of getting into the dungeon, like their own secret passage? That's not good. Means they can just get in and out whenever the fuck they want, with whatever the fuck they want. That's what Fels has to say. Oh, so this is the Gros guy. Oh, okay, I see. So that thing that the spider lady did, that was just to kill herself. So that, like, they wouldn't, the hunters wouldn't be able to do whatever they want with her body. Fair, but... So she said she leaves it to Gross, which is this guy. And he's another one of the monsters that, like, hates humans. So he doesn't even give a shit about, like, Fells or, um, what's his name? Uranos. Uh, he probably just wants to get revenge. So, yeah, that's, that's not good. Not good for us. Or lead, or any of them. Gross just doesn't care, man. He'll abandon it. It's not Bell. No. You Bell's gonna prove this man wrong. I know, like, I don't know, this show isn't too like focused on giving deep villain characters, so I don't know what they plan on doing with Gross here. Or Gross, however it's pronounced, sorry. Um but I can definitely see where he's coming from for, what, centuries, maybe even longer. Humans kill monsters. And I guess they still, like, humans are still terrified of them. So they still kill even the good ones. But he's not even giving Bell and them a chance, even though they were, they were hanging out. They were partying with them. Just, I don't know. It's, I can see where he's coming from, but, you know... I don't know, they, they, if, if they even, like, investigate, or, sorry, if they even, like, pan that out a little more, you know, Groza's character, uh, who knows, but, like, just, I, I see, I get him, I don't like him, but I get him. Going after him. Fuck, now they have to fight among themselves, too. Just what they needed. Wow. <laughs> That acid fucked them up. Rightfully. Oh. Was that like Gros and them coming to attack the village? Be made to cry that she'll kill them? That's not great to hear. I have to say. I can sort of see why, uh, in the OP, there's a scene of Bell and, uh, A's, like, fighting each other in that standoff. It's probably, something's gonna happen with the Xenos get in between them. That's, like, definitely, man, that's, it's gonna be tough. Like, she said if they cry, if they make someone cry, and, like, that's, 
impossible not to do because people are so terrified of monsters. Even the good ones would scare people. That just sucks, man. She'll have to change her mind. It, she's, like, she can be good, for sure. Oh, has been destroyed. Wait, so the whole village was, like, destroyed completely? Forbidden from entering. Damn. It must be the Xenos, right? Like, grows in them, they're just going beyond their boundaries. Further unwanted. Are they maybe gonna only let... Oh, the Ganesha family. Okay, I thought maybe they were gonna let Hestia family go. Maybe they still will. That wouldn't be so bad, except I don't know if Groz would listen to Bell at all. I think Lead would have to deal with Groz, just for it to, like, be right. Uh, what a shitty situation, man. Because this is just gonna, like, make people more, like, pissed at the monsters. Even the ones that are still good. Bell Cornell, yep. That was expected. Truth of that boy. They're testing him. See what he'd do. Man's a hero, man. He'll do something good. Bell's got this. Weapons. Oh, yeah. By Savage Gargoyle. Fucking gross, man. Summoned. Summoned for Belkin. Yeah, nice. Let's go, Bell. Only Bell, though? Is anyone else from the Familia gonna get brought in? Oh, if Eyes is, though. That's not good. Oh, Nicholas is just chilling on his own. Something fun. Okay, yeah. This guy's a bit of a psycho, maybe. Uh, just Bell, huh? So he's gonna have to just work with the Ganesha family? Hopefully, like, the Ganesha familia knows about the Xenos. I know Ganesha himself does. But Uranos was saying that only Bell is, like, hung out with the Xenos so far? I don't know. Hopefully something gets worked out there. And keeps them... Oh, so is the Ikelos family hanging out on the 18th floor? Is that why they're chilling there? Worried. I do not know what's going on with Hermes right now. Does he not trust Uranos? Or does he know something about the Xenos? With the Hermes? Ah. Really? Okay, so the Hermes family seems to know a lot more than everybody else, which, you know, I'm not surprised by. They got those connections. Is that allowed? Is she allowed to just say she's going to go? I feel like she would have had to be called upon, right? Hasn't come back. What, Icolus was supposed to show up? Man is just chilling. He's on the surface, just having a good time. Bring him alive. This isn't the entire Ganesha family, is it? God, that's huge. Oh. Bell being sneaky at the back. Nice, nice. Okay. So. Uh, I don't know how that's going to get worked out. Honestly. Because Gros and them attacking Laveria, uh, that's just going to get people more pissed at monsters. Hate them more. They're, they're trying to tame them instead of kill them, which I guess is a good step. Um, like a good, that's like better than what I expected, honestly. I don't know, it's just how they're going to clear up the monsters enough that the Xenos, the good Xenos at least, can like not be like seen in such a bad light that's gonna be difficult for sure i i don't know aranos is he like the head honcho in there or something 
he seems to have a lot of power. I it has been a while since I watched like the first few episodes, so I could very well be forgetting something. It's just I can't. He seems like he might be in charge of like the whole dungeon. Is he? Like he can just control who gets to get sent in and who doesn't. Seems like might like he's probably like the biggest power and at least you know he's on our side kind of with the monsters but damn i i don't know it seems like the hermes familia is up to something weird i don't know if i trust them or not and like it looked like the freya like freya was questioning it i don't know if she'll do shit though she kind of just likes to sit and watch all the time anyway and like loki god knows i don't know if like Ains or A's, whatever. Yeah, A's is gonna uh, join or not, and like get this whole fight thing going on between her and Bell. I, it's possible, but I, I don't know. But yeah, that that was just a bit of a shit show <laughs> altogether. Yeah, it's I don't know. It's kind of nice though that Bell doesn't have the rest of his familia going with him. Because we're so used to seeing them all, like, together doing shit. I kind of want to see what Bell can do on his own. Like, with a different Familia, sure. But, I don't know, it doesn't... He won't have, like, Hestia to give him, like, inspirational quotes. Or, like, um, Welf and Lily's combat abilities. It's... Of course, they could pull, like, a Season 1 and Hestia will just come in anyway. But... It'd be nice if he had, like, one expedition with none of them. Just see what the heck he can do without relying on his friends that much. Maybe that's just me. I, I don't know. It's just interesting. Kind of change things up a bit, you know. Anyway, though, I think I'm just going to end it there because, like, yeah, that we basically saw. Like, I talked about it as it was going and, like, it's one heck of a thing. I, I don't know. I really have no idea how they're going to sort this shit out. It's beyond me. They'll, I'm sure Bell or somebody will figure something out, but like, god dang. I guess we're not even halfway through yet. So, like, we got a bit. Got a bit. Um, yeah, that's, that's where I'm going to end it. Uh, if you guys enjoyed, be sure to drop a like. Subscribe. Uh, comment if you did enjoy. Let me know what you guys think of, like, Don Maki. You, you like it? You love it? Uh, you want to see more of it? Just go ahead, let me know. And, uh, yeah. That's it for me. So, hope you guys have a wonderful day. And I will talk to you all later. Peace.